Well, hello to the world's coolest mom. Oh, <laughs> yes, now that I drink lean. I, I don't know how many people watching this know what it is. I didn't know what it was. It's scary. What, what actually is it? I think people are still a little confused. Well, you have to ask Vince, who seems to know all of this stuff somehow. It's what the rappers drink, is what he told me. They mix uh, cough syrup and... <laughs> This was brand new to me. Well, do you know, I'm, I might not try it this Christmas. I, um, I don't think that sounds too safe. But, I mean, I think you'd have a very Merry Christmas if you, if you do partake. I think you would, but I think you can see in the movie that it does have an after effect that might not be desirable. I, I might avoid it then, but uh, I, I do have to ask you, would you ever invite one of your child's exes over to Christmas? Okay, my daughter's right here. And uh, would I invite one of her exes to Christmas? That's totally something I would do. <laughs> it's something I would do as well. I, so tell me when you first um, you know, were reading the script, did you identify with the character at all? Uh, I absolutely did. Not all of it, of course. She's, I'm not R-rated. She does R-rated things. But yes, as far as getting attached to your children's dates, the people that they're with... You do embrace them and you hate to give them up. I feel like sometimes, I even know with my own parents, sometimes they end up choosing the spouse or the boyfriend and girlfriend over the kid. Like they much prefer the spouse over the actual child. And they're like, come on, get them back in. Well, you see what kind of a child we have as Alex Moffat plays him. And so it, it is clear that we sort of prefer his girlfriend to him. <laughs> so we invite her to Christmas. So I've got, you know, talking about Christmas, what are your Christmas plans? What are you, do you have a ritual that you usually follow at Christmas? Or? No, we don't have a ritual. It's very hard after the kids are grown, you don't really quite know what to do as an adult on Christmas. I've never fully figured it out. It's a little different every year. This year, my daughter will be with us. She's, I mean, she's going back to New York, but she'll be back in L.A. for Christmas. Oh, very nice. And I've got to ask, favorite Christmas song? Do I have a favorite Christmas song? <laughs> um, I'm trying to think. It, well, it might be Winter Wonderland. Winter Wonderland. It's easy to sing and it's Absolutely. fun. Absolutely. And talk to me about working with Vince Vaughn. How was that? It was wild. I've never worked like that before. We would do it straight like a Hallmark movie, every scene. And then we would do wild things and improvise. And Vince would throw things at us. So there were sort of two versions because he still wanted it to be a movie where you cared what happened to the heroine and that everybody ended up happy, just like in a Hallmark movie. And yet, it would upend your, your notions of a Hallmark movie at every turn. Oh, wow. So we kind of shot every scene two ways. I've never worked like that before. Right. So it's probably somewhere in between, it's, but then you've all, you could have a completely naughty version and a completely clean version. So maybe we'll get the completely naughty version at some point. Well, I don't even know how naughty this version is. I'll find out tonight. But from what I've seen in the trailer and when I was doing looping for it, I, a, lot, a lot of the naughty is left in, apparently. Well, that's good. Well, that's a big part of Christmas. So thank you so much. It was so nice to talk to you. You too. Thank you. Of course. Fab, Fab TV. TV. Fab, because we're fabulous.